And welcome to this week's episode of Young Techs. I'm Shireen Ban. The India story is linked closely to its demographic profile for well, not just the world's largest democracy but also the youngest. This advantage could turn to be a liability if the government and the private sector don't focus on skilling, employability and providing basic education. So on the show today we bring you stories of three ventures who've made educating India their business. Our first guest gave up on the American dream for a chance to change the way students think and learn. 33-year-old Baiju Ravindran decided to focus on the much sought-after competitive examination market to help students prepare and crack the entrance exams from engineering to medicine to the IAS and even the SAT and GMAT. Founded in 2008, Think and Learn has grown from addressing the needs of 250 students to over 20,000 students today and with the launch of the K-12 tablet, Baiju hopes to capture an even bigger market through distance learning. Take a look at how this National Math Olympiad winner is multiplying revenues and adding customers. Every weekend in Bangalore, over 2,000 students assemble in a classroom to get ready to bell the cat. The man cracking the whip is Baiju Ravindran. A cat topper and National Mathematics Olympiad winner, Baiju decided to ditch the IAMs to start Think and Learn, the parent company of Baiju's classes. For Baiju, having grown up in a family of teachers, education seemed to be a natural fit. What started as a cat training institute with just 250 students in 2008, today prepares students for UPSC, engineering entrances, GMAT and the GRE. Realizing that there is an upper limit to the number of students he can reach out to if he continues with a brick and mortar model, Baiju started identifying best teachers across India and today reaches out to students in different parts of the country through VSAT centers. But what's different about Baiju's class? What most of the, all the other coaching institutes do is they basically identify the patterns and uh, make them practice hundreds of questions so that they get familiar with all the previous questions and all. We don't concentrate on that. We basically teach students the principles so that they can actually solve any question. We teach them how to expect questions, how to predict questions rather than solve questions made by someone else. Uh, what we mainly train them is on, uh, uh, they, they will be in a position to uh, expect questions. And uh, more, than, more than questions, it's not just about uh, doing well in the exams. They will clearly understand the concepts and so that uh, they will be able to frame those questions. With 60 centers pan India, Baiju's class isn't cheap with students shelling out anywhere between 6,000 to 50,000 rupees a year. Having already grossed revenues of 14 crore rupees, Think and Learn received its first round of funding of whopping $10 million in December 2012 from the Manipal Group. So what made the chairman of Manipal Global Education Services and the former Infosys CFO Mohandas Pai bet on Baiju? We heard of him first when in Manipal we found a rush of young people going to a class. And when we inquired as to why they're doing that, we found that there was a, a person by the name of Baiju Ravindran who was taking classes for them to enable them to uh, pass their uh, classes in the IAM. And they were very, very happy with him and the success rate was extraordinarily high. So when we contacted him and requested for a meeting, he came and he spoke to us and he explained. And we found that he was a wonderful entrepreneur who has hit upon a successful idea and uh, who has made sure that the idea actually works. He has tested it out. He has led from the front, done many things himself. He has opened to change. He has changed uh, the way of doing things based upon responses. And overall, we felt here is a wonderful person whom we have to back. He's got a great business idea. And this idea is truly transformational. And that's the reason why uh, we thought we should invest in it. With financial backing, Baiju is all set for the next growth phase and he's betting on the power of tablets to take his classes to students anytime, anywhere. These K-12 tablets launched in February this year are preloaded with adaptive text, animation, videos and practice tests. Currently, the content is only available for engineering and medical entrance exams in Bangalore. The team at Think and Learn is now working on adding courses and taking the tablet Pan India by next year. For the next three years, uh, we will be getting into 
the school education segment where we will be coming out with products in maths and science through tablet which will be in a completely uh, adaptive platform and uh, revenue numbers which we are expecting over there in the next three years is uh, close to 100 crores because in, in, in three years uh, in the last three years we've been doubling our revenue without any investment now with the investment as well as with lot more uh, brilliant minds coming together joining us we will be able to come out with uh, uh, products across test preparation segments as well as in the school segments in math and math and science it through tablets with an eye on scoring revenues of 100 crore rupees over the next 3 years byju is all set to kick start think and learn foray into the school segment to prepare students from class 8 onwards by supplementing their school studies the bigger goal however for this state level player is to make students teach how to learn Find you more power to you and think and learn. On that note, it's time for a break. But when we return, the story of an entrepreneur who's empowering children in urban and rural India with his venture, Sudhiksha Knowledge Solutions. That story and more on Young Turks.